All right, this is perfect. The next achievement is, you guys can't see my cursor, but it's there. It, oh, you could if I move it. No, you still can't. Okay, it is ghostly transformation. Obtain the perks, hungry ghost, angry ghost, and mournful spirit in one run. We have hungry ghost. Let's go. Okay, from the YouTube comments. If I freeze Steve, I can kill them with a single kick. Wait, are those three symbols water? The three little bubbles in the background. I don't know who Steve is. Is Steve the statue? Is Steve death? Is Steve somebody on the subreddit? Because we were also talking about me going onto the Noida subreddit. Or it was mentioned. The world may never know. Or I might get a response to this video. Who knows? Okay. We got good stuff going. Possibly Steve has his head stuck up in the wall. If this is Steve. Are you Steve? I don't know. Onward, downward, coal pits. Bouncing shot is amazing for mixing up water. Did you see how quickly I got rid of that toxic sludge? And we have a little mini machine gun. Look at that. Mini machine guns are awesome in the context of Noida. And they'd probably be pretty fun to shoot just for fun in real life. I don't know. I'm not super big on shooting. It's all right. I'm too cheap to enjoy shooting. I just think of how much the ammo costs, which right now is quite a bit. Okay. Maybe I should have that machine gun wand is my first wand, because it's pretty good. I think I should. You do have chainsaw. You're decent. But I think I want my panic button to be the machine gun. When did this all drop? Okay, I have a hungry ghost. It sometimes eats projectiles. That doesn't sound the most helpful. It seems like it would be good after I've gotten a bunch of other defensive perks. Like after fire immunity and explosion immunity and projection projectile resistance. After all of those, then I would like to see Hungry Ghost. All right, we see a wand. The only issue with this machine gun is it does very little damage. Okay, how do I get down to this? Huh. Just by going around, maybe? Chill out. Ah, I got hit. I almost got hit by the glitter bomber for the first time ever. The glitter bomber makes me think of some sci-fi time looping movie. I can't think what it's called. It's decent and it's like way underrated. Um, yeah, I don't know at all. And I can't think of the actor's name the actor or the actress. But I think he's the glitter bomber in it. Or there is a glitter bomber character in it. I don't know. Decent movie. Kind of weird. Kind of cool. All right. Nothing to do with glitter bombers in this game. I'm out of water. Mistakes have been made. Okay, give me back this. We got this. Ah, 
I'm already down at the bottom. I have very little gold. I'm not doing a good job mixing this water. I got hurt somehow. There's a good amount of water right there. There was a wand I wanted. It's right above me. Hmm. This is pretty annoying. So in theory, I could like jump off a cliff and then, no, return backwards. <laughs> I took damage. Okay. There's gold that I can't access. There has to be some way I can get through to that. I see wood. There's wood right there. I need to go find a wand with explosives on it. Did the hungry ghost eat one of those shots? Did you actually do something for me? Possibly. Okay. This wand could have explosives on it. Or the wand itself could just be really good. Okay, the wand itself is really good. Too bad it only has two capacity. I just got the last piece to make, like, a pretty awesome wand. I just need to find the wand itself, the base wand. And maybe a couple other pieces, but I got all the important ones. Okay, I don't have a lot of water. Wait, I have chainsaw on this wand. I technically could dig. Okay, I'm stuck. And if I get myself stuck like that, I can take out whole rectangles of pixels. All of the pixels. That's exploding. It's such a long way to make it through. If I go over to where the wood is, but I can't even access where the wood is. Where is the weakest point through? I don't think it's all the way up here. This is painful. I don't like it. But I also don't want to move on without looking at that wand. I need a good wand right now. I could just go to the fungal area. I'm going to hit rock that's going to be hard to break through even with a chainsaw. This is so stupid. I'm kind of stuck. Okay, not really. I should have gone from the left, probably, or the right. Directions are difficult. Please tell me I can get through this stone. I think I can. I think I can. I think I can. I can. Okay, there's one more spot that could be tough is the cobblestone looking stuff right at the edge of breaking through. If I get myself stuck in the little gap in front of me, then again, maybe I can delete a whole rectangle worth of pixels. I can't really get myself stuck. All right, back in a second. Success! I made it through without even making it all the way through. What do we got? We got, eh, I mean, it's okay. Why do I have return? I mean, return is what made it through there, but I need that return. 
No. I think I have to get rid of my best wand now. Because this wand's more important than this wand. I have to. Goodbye. Okay. So that changes things a little bit. You go here. I used my return to get through that little bit of gap that still existed. There are plasma cutters. Plasma cutters have only gotten me killed every time I think I've ever used them. This time will be different. This time will definitely be different. Okay. I got the wand. <laughs> he should be so thankful that I didn't make you suffer through watching that. It was so painful. A single chainsaw is not a good digging wand. It can do it. It's not pretty. Look at all this gold I'm getting. See, this wand paid for itself. I just have to remember not to jump upwards. I just deleted all of that gold. Give me. No, I didn't think I still had that wand selected. Right, I no longer have. I was thinking that I was on my chainsaw one because this wand used to be on two, but now it's on one, but I got rid of the one that was on one. Will you get me out, please? You did. Thank you. Okay, we're good on water. Good, because I don't like having this toxic stuff around me. It's ruining my vibe. No toxicity, man. Cool. That thing is creating so much toxic slime. What ate through this? What is that? Volcanic rock, maybe? There's so much gold over here that's disappearing. Okay. I have to remember, I do have the plasma thing that I could technically use as a weapon, but it's really scary. Like, really scary. Okay. See? Look at how scary that was. Okay, we've done it. I have 41 HP. I think I'm gonna have to leave soon. I have decent stuff, I think. This wand is a shuffle. This one has six slots. I can make use of that. I did look at that, right? Did I look at that? I assume I looked at that. I must have looked at you. Is there no- I did not look at this. That's a tough call. It's got really bad recharge time. It's got two chainsaws. I want it. Do I want it more than return? There's another wand. Okay. We're gonna not hurt ourselves. I don't know how that one ended up hurting me. Okay, good stuff. Yes, shuffle, but really good recharge times. Linear arc is interesting. It really is. Huh. Some of these could be better than return is. There's the smallest chance that there's something underneath this gunpowder. Okay, there definitely was not. I feel kind of like I should change this out for the return. It's 
stupid, but it's what I'm doing. Chainsaws are so good. For how early you can get it, I think it might be the best spell in the game. It's up there. That I've encountered so far. But the ones that I haven't encountered aren't going to be like early game spells. They're going to be later stuff. Why did that feel like the world was collapsing? Spark Bolt could be really good. Okay, I should actually... Why is everything shaking so much? There's a stupid number of chainsaws for 300. Now I don't need to waste 300. Of all of these, this one's a shuffle. This one's a shuffle. This one has seven slots. Decent. Eh, it's okay. I already have a six slot. The spark bolt's the only one that I think interests me. Low recoil. But your spells fly slightly slower. I think I take this one. This one's just good. Okay, non-shuffle. Good stuff. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Take you. Get rid of you. Take you. Put you on here. These cost one mana, which shouldn't really matter. But it doesn't really matter if I have two chainsaws on there or not either. Maybe it does. Are you Steve? I don't know if you're Steve. I'm not instant casting. I think I would instant cast. No. understand okay so my question now and I can't really test this is this going twice where every one time through the wand it actually reduces mana drain by 60 or only by 30 to test that I would need an expensive spell like this one which could get me in trouble but it shouldn't get me in trouble right Okay, it gets me in a little bit of trouble. That shot further than I was expecting because of the repulsion field. I can't tell. Because the 52 mana charge speed, I don't know. I think maybe this add mana was going twice. Maybe. Five seventy max mana. This one's decent. Except he only has the two slots, but I could put a black hole on there. Hmm. Let's do it. The only thing is, I don't really want to give up that black hole wand. Do I take Spark Bolt with Trigger? I got rid of my return. This wand doesn't currently do much damage. It just shoots very rapidly. Hmm. I could take Bubble Spark. I don't think I do any of that. I think... I'm just happy with this shooting rapidly. To get out of here for free. No. Okay. Let's do this. Downward. Into the ice cave. The snowy depths. Okay, 
I pissed off that frost thing. Look at how much frozen death it created. I can dig a bit. I'm not like a straight up earthworm, but I'm getting there. The funny thing is, if I would have put the double scatter spell, I'd actually be able to dig better. Like, because it would dig slightly wider. I'm pretty sure. This is going to end up freezing that water. So I shouldn't do that. This is the way that we play the game now. Again, I do have black holes. Okay, chill. I have to be careful about getting stuck in that water, so I'm actually going to drain the water out. Because that water turning into ice scares me a little. I see electricity up above me. Okay, I create a whole bunch of really small, really weak projectiles very rapidly. This is a small teleport with downward bolt bundle. That's so scary. Why? Why does the game do these things? No shuffle six slots, no shuffle three slots, no shuffle seven slots. Now we're talking. That wand is good. And it's got a small teleport that I'm afraid to actually make use of. Okay, I'm afraid to actually... Why would I break through that? Look at how safe I am with my little ghost buddy here to protect me from projectiles. Okay. Easy game. Did you see how quickly we slew that beast? This one's pretty useless. I could drink some of this. I think I might be eating some snow. Yes. Snow's good for you. Okay, to get through this rock, I'm supposed to electrically charge this in some way or break that wood in some way. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I have repulsion field too, it's a weak one. I can't teleport through this. Can I cut through with a chainsaw? I do have a black hole. I think I use the black hole. It was not worth using the black hole. Okay. You never know until you do it. That, there's no scary explodey stuff except for the skulls. Where is that skull? I think there can only be good stuff buried in the snow. Famous last words. Rat! At one point you would have been my friend. I did see that shot that that one just shot get repulsed. There's so much gold down there. There we go. A wand. Crappy wand. Okay. 
I have no qualms with you, robot thing. Okay, am I over in the area where I could go up? I am. I kind of want to mess with the teleport wand. Did I collapse the one area? The one area. I don't think I did. No, I did. Was there one? I collapsed them all. Okay, never mind then. I did leave spell refreshers, though. If I could go up there and edit the teleport wand, then I would. I think I have to go down to edit the teleport. Kind of stuck. I don't know why I like digging in snow so much. I do. It's gonna get me killed in the next area. I just need a digging drill, whatever it's called. Not the green lightsaber one, the other one. Digging bolt. Whatever it is, I need that. That would turn me into full-on earthworm mode. Look at how good bouncing shot is. You guys just don't understand bouncing shot. I would say you don't understand Chainsaw, but everybody seems to value Chainsaw a lot, so I can't say that one. I like the idea of Spark Bolt quite a bit. Do I like it more than Double Scatter? Yes. Huh. I think the Repulsion Field is helping me quite a bit. is why I took it. Oh, I did not see that enemy. I saw the robot up there. Crap. Crap. so weird the way that angles work for bouncing shots in this game. I would expect right here to bounce back and hit them, instead it bounces back to me. Which just seems strange. Unlimited oil, basically. A lot of these shots aren't even hurting it, but they're generating free oil. When it dies, I think it will burst into flames. Or if it shoots off its little missile, it will. <laughs> Tempting fate. This is fine. Let's let the fire settle down a little bit. I didn't even end up killing it after all that. Okay, I see the portal out. That is good. My health is still good. I just don't think of this area as a place with good stuff to, like, look for. I guess wands, and that's about it. Of all the areas, this one seems kind of like it's the worst. I guess it's cool because it can lead back up to the first area, 
otherwise. So far, it's kind of lame. But maybe there are zones off to the side, to the left side that I just haven't explored. You scare me. But I could sneak up on it from below and die. I regret everything. Ha! No! No! Whatever, I got some of the gold. A giant pile of snow? Yes, I will. Okay. Yeah, this would dig so much quicker if it was just a little bit wider, I think. There is an area to the left. It's super dark and scary, and I don't like it, and I don't know if it has anything cool in it. I remember. Let me through. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Free gold. I do see a flask over there. Ooh, max HP. I take back all of the negative things I said about this level, kind of, a little bit. But not really. The jungle still seems way better for max HP. I don't trust this not to freeze on me. I'm trying to drain out the water, but kind of failing. Because it keeps freezing. Also, I'm kind of breaking the sounds. I kind of broke the sounds. Okay, we want mods. I think I hit... No, I did hit the right thing. Restart. We're back. Now, with sound. Okay. So, creating stupid amounts of projectiles can create problems. This is without me putting any particle effect. I need to... Why would I do that? I don't know. I need to stop going with the bouncing shot. It's not my fault. It is my fault. Look at how zoomy we are. you see all the gold I just made? It's a lot of water. That is a potion that I care about. Right? Polymorph it is. I want that potion. In order to get that potion, I have to kill those rats without firing near that potion. There's also a mountain of snow. No, 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 my polymorph. No! I... 
I need it. Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. I picked it up. Did I pick it up? If I die to a rat, this is gonna be so sad. They're also polymorphed. I did pick it up. I'm a genius. That was so stupid. I wanted it. Hello, rat friends. Thank you for not killing me and humiliating me. What? This can spawn in this level? For some reason, I thought it couldn't. Okay, we've got Polymorph. I've got lots of gold. I see sparkles in this snow. Don't get stuck in the blood. All right, I think I could move on pretty soon. But I see a bunch of gold up there. Ooh, and more importantly, I see a wand. Forget the gold. Maybe. I guess I don't want these sneaking up on me while I'm trying to get the wand. Yeah, that repulsion field is really good. I keep saying it, but it's still true. Reduce spread. Triple spell. Shuffle with eight slots. Meh. shot yes yes okay speed up crit plus are both amazing stronger hearts um vampirism oil blood I don't know I feel like there are other ways to heal. Getting max HP seems so good. All three of those were amazing. Immunity to fire. There's. I like the other immunity to fire a little bit more. They were all so good. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I've got teleport. That's really nice. This is supposed to be my main wand. Damage isn't fully reflective because it's not showing the crit pluses. I think I have to take this back off of the wand. I could put one of these on a wand. I can leave one up here. This is important.
Okay, I'm planning on keeping this wand regardless, so I could do that. I don't know how things wrapping around works. Like, is this somehow stronger than the other way? Because is the crit now affecting this chainsaw? Or does it have to go like this? So that this affects the... I just don't know all the way. I'm not sure. This seems to work for whatever reason. Oops. And all of the spells should be affected by crit at least. Teleport is nice. That'll be my second wand. Plasma is scary. These wands are pretty equivalent. Yeah, I guess it doesn't matter. Do I care about any of these? No. Grab the heal. I don't know how much I want to hang out in this next area, so I might just try and knock it out really quick right now. I can teleport out of here. Let's try and do that. I think I'm getting better at those teleports. It's been a little while since I missed one. I think. Okay, that's... More enemies than I was expecting. This place is, like, full of enemies. I didn't take the vampirism. I need max HP hearts so bad. I think I left one in the first area, but I could be thinking back to one of my other failed runs. Okay, there are wands all over the place. This is not going to be a quick level after all. This is a scary level. That scared me. You have a wand now. Of course you do. I'm going to create so much blood, and I didn't take vampirism. I do like that triple shot. That's scary. No, why would I do that? I'm floating upwards, and that stuff rises. I would do that because I have to do that. I see two of those death containers. There's so many frozen death containers. I did look at that wand, right? Yeah. Okay, I don't see signs of frozen death in this pile of snow. I do see one over there. I 
kind of just want to defuse them all. Which is tough to do. Random sniper kill without even meaning to. This pile of snow scares me. This pile of snow scares me. Crap. That amount of lag feels like my sounds are about to get desynced again, maybe. Or they're approaching it. Those canisters can fly off in random directions, too, which would be pretty scary. Okay, what do I have on plasma? Giant firebolts. Okay. And teleport. You! You're not a healer. What are you? I do have the thing to make you friendly. Here, be my friend for a second. You do heal me! You are friend! Thank you, friend. How do I get away from you without you dying? I can't. I need two friends that can heal each other and me. I also just need to get away from it. I think I did get away from my he No! Do not follow me! There's nothing good for you this way. You stupid. You're gonna end up dead. It's not my fault! Wait! You are both friends! Oh, I killed one. Hello, friend. I'm still at full health. I don't need to heal. I just want my friend to follow me. Here, let's go up here. Have you considered how nice it might be up by the top? Look, there's a little force field thing. You could hang out there. Not the quickest getaway, but I think we made it. I associate this with like a potion room, but that might not be accurate. Looks like there's gold on the floor, maybe. Okay. My health is still decent. I'm not immune to fire, though. I see a wand. It's a really good wand, or at least it has a lot of really good spells on it. What is this? Why does this box have one green line and three red lines? Explain yourself. Huh. Don't know. Another wand. Not a very good one. What is that potion? I can't tell. I still can't tell. I don't think I can get through to it without destroying it. We're really looking for max HP. How am I already down at the bottom? No! I thought I was about to light on fire. I can get electrocuted from those lights. Okay. I want to pierce that canister. I don't want to come up right there. 
That was a healer friend. I'm at the anvil, but I don't have a broken wand. I wish I did. That's a whole lot of enemies up there. What? Black hole with death trigger. A slow or all obstacles casts another spell as it expires. Bubbly bounce, double spell. I think I have to take these. I didn't even pay attention. The wand was a shuffle. I don't know if it was any good or not. It's a shuffle, who cares? Kaboom. I'm only at 52 minutes. We did do this area pretty quickly. Is that gold? That is gold. Free gold. Free blood. Okay, somehow I've kind of exposed that. Okay, acceleration potion. Crit is so good. It improved this spell so much. It's not strong enough for the next area, but it's decent. It won't take much more to get it to be good enough. Crap, 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 crap. I'm getting hurt because I was oily, I think. So greedy and I want the gold. Okay, I should be able to refill my water bottle if I break through this. No, let me out. Is chilly water different from normal water? Chilly water plus water, it is different. That could mess with me, but I... I don't know if it will or not. It definitely could. I'm glad I checked that. So at least I'm aware that it could mess with me. Speaking of which, there's toxic ice. Probably because I threw chili water. I don't know. Wonder what this is. I do see the chest. There was a potion of s no, it was a wand. 
two quad casts, 12 slots, decent stats. I do have more teleports. I could give up this one. I think I do that. Just because I have more short teleports in my inventory. Okay, I don't want that frozen death coming up to me. Okay, none of the chilly water seems to be freezing. Right, this is a problem because the corpses start to block everything. To get to this chest, I do have a bunch of black holes I could be using. But, max mana 520, they would go off like crazy. I kind of want to try it. The bubbly bounce might hurt a bit. It might not. <laughs> okay, it didn't do as crazy as I thought. But it kind of did. I'm on fire. I'm stuck. I do still have a teleport, but it has something weird with it. No, I think it's just quad casts and a light. I think I'm safe to use the teleport. Somehow that chest is accessible pretty much, but not blown open yet. Oh, it was a mimic. Bad chest. Yes. Purple glimmer. Luminous drill with timer. There's an argument that these are better than this. I think because I have so many chainsaws, it's not necessary. If it was a regular luminous drill, I would value it more. I do want to go see that. What is that blue liquid? I don't like that electricity. That's what the blue liquid was. You're a healer, friend. I think I need these big magic guards. I don't know if they're actually any good, but they seem like they could be. Digging to dig. That thing would blow up into electricity. I think I just go down at this point. I feel like I have decent stuff. More max HP would be nice, but... Okay, why is there frozen death down here? I got rid of my teleport. Spiders could end up pissing off the gods. 
crit on what? What is this one? Homebringer. Bloodlust. Bloodlust is interesting. Always cast aiming arc. Freeze charge is pretty important. That's probably the most important thing I've seen so far. Especially if Steve is death. Because then I could run up and kick it. Revenge explosion. Revenge tentacle is pretty good. I don't care much about this one because eventually I want to get explosion immunity anyways. I think I can do better. Unlimited spells. Double gold. I could reroll again. The problem is, unlimited spells doesn't work with the ones that I really care about. I don't know if I've taken phasing before. I don't know if it has a downside. It doesn't say that it does, but it seems too strong. Or if, like, they can end up hitting me multiple times because they phase through me, like slow-moving projectile. I don't know. It feels like it has to have some downside. I have to take this one. I kind of think I have to take this one, but maybe not. Okay. Yes, shuffle. Yes, shuffle. Lots of chainsaws. Big magic guard. Spells cast three. I think I could use this spells cast three. I don't really want this. I think those magic guards are giving it, or that one magic guard is giving it a cast delay. Do you hurt? I'm so tempted. You do hurt that. Holy magic guard is amazing. already seen two wands for next time too. Okay. Don't I have another? I have another one of these. It's right there. This does add some delay to it. Because of the way that chainsaws work, sometimes it's double casting stuff in weird ways. I think I could put more of my chainsaws on here. Just to make room. Chainsaw is a weird spell. Okay, I wanted to make room. I wanted to get ice. To get ice. And it's got an always cast. And it's got 550 mana charge speed. 
Is it an always cast that I care about? Not too much. I just wish it had more slots. Oh, weird. If I put that aiming arc on a black hole... With the projectile speed up... It might actually do crazy things, except its max man is too low to use it. Darn it. So is this the way? Oh, I don't even need the multicast. It always casts three spells. Maybe I do, though, because I'm trying to do the wrap chainsaw. Darn it. I like that so much more than bouncing. I think. I could do both. No, I can't. I need the chainsaw. Right. The auto target was on this one. Recharge time is bad. Kind of surprised it's as bad as it is, though. Hmm. I'm not sure. This one is a shuffle. Um, I don't want this to cast my multiple black holes, but it's gonna. of this junk. Keep some of the better things. That means that I can take some of these black holes off of here. Is three slots enough? Four slots should be good. I don't really want to give up my projectile speed either though, even though it is fun on the black holes. Can I fight death? Probably. If I could throw freeze onto this, I definitely could. I don't need to fight death. I have a teleport.
<laughs> Too much thought required. Seeing some pretty crazy damage numbers sometimes pop up from this. It's interesting. If I look at that magic guard, Castellay, it doesn't tell me anything about how much damage it does. Interesting. That 339 number. It seems like it's while the spinning thing is moving through it, it's basically just doing piercing damage. So like, I teleport and then it has to move quickly to catch up to me. Where if I just walk through, it doesn't seem to do that same amount of damage. That's what I'm thinking at least. I saw 1600 there. It's something with, or it's just a glitchy thing with the statue. One of the two. All right, for now, that does it for this video. Next time, we're gonna see if I can find the pieces to make this run become insane. All right, thanks for watching. Have a good one.